I don't know who Jeffrey is. I'm just confused about the conversation. I just walk right out. I'm like, I'm not even. I'm like, whatever. In my head, I'm like, this guy is 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 a we is is. He's a buster, man. Like, I don't understand. I don't understand this dude. Um, so when Tasha asked me, I have a name of who I could expose, you know, at that point. But I don't say nothing in the, in the interview. I'm like, I don't know. But then the receipts came. Okay. Homie, long story short, man, you're a male escort. Um, you do anything for clout. Okay. The receipts are there. I can't spare you no more. And I, I, I'm only doing this, unfortunately, is because you've been paper cutting me. You, you're, you, you're really trying to play this daddy, big da- um, stepdaddy role way too fast, you know. Okay, so you guys are in my DMs wanting me to address a video that was posted. But I already posted my truth. I already shared my story with you. It's the 100% God-given truth. Okay, I don't address fake news and I don't address liars. What is there to address? If the video is a lie, why am I going to respond to those lies? It's, there's no point. So if you want to know the truth, it's on my channel. That's it. Somebody's gay. I know I ain't gay, 
And if somebody next to me gay, I don't give a fuck what he like. I'm going to be his friend because he's cool and he's a fucking cool ass person. Not because he like what he like. It don't matter. That's what the world is. So y'all make sure y'all just stay tuned on that. Stop worrying about all the other BS. Come on outside, baby. I'm downstairs. I'm right here at the valet. And um, y'all make sure y'all just stay focused on that, man. Don't worry about all the other BS. It's gonna, this ain't going to be the first fake... I just feel like I'm moving at the right pace. How do you feel about the fact that he called your gay scene gay? I feel like Adam doesn't know him through a, a hole in the wall. You don't know what he has going on in his personal life. And I was quite upset about that because you're being judgmental on a person that you don't even know. Um, this guy that I'm currently seeing, he has a lot of gay friends, okay? He trains a lot of gay clients, you know? And just because he's comfortable and confident in his own skin doesn't mean that he's gay. And I know for a fact that he's not. So it's just hurtful that people try to attack gay as being something that's wrong. You know what I'm saying? Because it's not. People have their own preferences. So I'm actually quite offended for the LGBTQ community that Adam would even say such things. And let's just say, for example, this guy had a gay history, you know? What does that even matter? We live in 2021, and at the end of the day, that's something that 